Hey there, everybody. Welcome back to Axiom Verge. Uh, we're going to go through... We're kind of moving along. 15% of the map. That's not bad. 10% items. Some of the items are hidden in the walls, though, which is nuts. So many destructible walls. Last time, uh, we got the... A new cool gadget. I don't remember how we use it. It's like one of the triggers or bumpers or something. Yeah, it's this right here. Uh, where we can kind of go around and uh, glitch stuff. And all this cool garbage shows up over on the other side of the screen, which is appreciated. Where do we need to go, though? I'm not positive. And there's all sorts of cool little tricks that we can do. So I think we need to keep experimenting and seeing what all we can make happen. Because, you know, we're able to kill all those guys. We talked about that in a previous episode, but that's really, really neat. So I think we need to keep exploring that. Okay, I could, could I not get high enough in that room or what? There were a lot of areas around here that seemed I needed, but you can make platforms out of stuff. So it seemed that I needed some, well, I need to go over into there. I mean, that's just, what's up? It seemed that I needed to create some platforms of some kind. I really thought maybe I would kill it. I guess I didn't actually think that. I was just kind of hoping. Let's just get going here. We can drill this. Okay. I didn't notice this before for some reason. Okay, but... I don't like the way this looks. What if we... Just gonna do this. I'm gonna murder this thing somehow. Hey, you're murdered. Fantastic. Okay. Switch back to that. Try and drill through this. Can I jump this? Yes, I can. Get equipped. We've got some new awesome stuff going on. Power note, permanently increases permanent item damage. Amazing. We actually don't have items yet, do we? Unless these count as items, but I don't think that's the case. Well, then today was already worth it. We got power up. We're doing all right. Doing some good stuff. Oh my goodness, I almost jumped right into that. So we died rather quickly in here, I believe. I don't think we got to a dead end. Yeah, because this weird ant dude was up there. We had trouble dealing with him. I'm trying to utilize it like if my... I'm using the controls all wrong. Is this doing anything? It's kind of hard to tell if it's doing anything. And then we had some difficult platforming with the steam and what have you, and we passed away rather quickly, so. Can't jump that. Oh man, I'm jumping crazy. Getting crazy here. Alright, gotcha. Can't make that jump, so that's a problem. We're farther than we were before, though. This kind of remind me of the uh, of Thousand and One Spike Scorpions, just a little tiny bit. Just a little bit. And that whole area right there was a little Castlevania-esque. Alright, not really anything here. Not really anything I can do here. Oh, man. You don't want to get too close to those guys. Alright, there's all sorts of not good stuff going on here. Oh, I thought I could jump that. No, 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 no. Bad stuff. Bad stuff. Bad stuff. Oh, come on! Did it see me? Should I have waited till its back was turned? Oh, so annoying. Oh, back here, like I said before, though, I mean, the death penalties aren't that bad. I assume it, I mean, it, considering what type of game this is, it might affect uh, what ending you get. There could be multiple endings. There could be a bad ending type of scenario if you die too much. Uh, that happens sometimes in games like this. It's not like the norm, I would suppose, or I would go so far to say, but it is something that they sometimes do. It might not be in this one. That is super handy, being able to just take out all those guys at once. So it's worth trying to do every enemy, right? But it's like weaker enemies, so I know we couldn't do it to the uh, spider dudes that jump along the ceiling. We couldn't do it to them. I really need to take less damage in this room is the thing. Um, to help me do that, I should change to this thing. It's not really working. There we go. But now I can't jump back over the thing, though. What a pain in the ass! 
Alright, gotcha. Alright, let's just, it's fine. Everything's fine. There, one hit. That's way better than we did last time. It's perfect. Okay, so we couldn't glitch out those guys, which was kind of an issue. Um, I wonder if we can do the... I wonder if we can do these dudes. But I don't want to get too close to them because they immediately freak out and hit you. But I would like to try and glitch out the scorpion dudes up there. See if there's something we can do with that. I think that needs to become pretty much part of our standard operating procedures to try and glitch stuff out. So we've glitched him out. He's all a weird color now. And he shoots way less. Well, he shoots a little bit faster, it looks like, but it's not that spread shot, meaning that as long as they're below us, or above us for that matter, we should be able to get some pretty good hits in on him. Fuck. It's a little hard because we can't stand still and aim this thing, so... I like the rapid fire weapon. I mean, it gives us a lot of options, I think. Plus, they crap out a bunch of health when you kill them that way because that was two in a row, and health generally has been pretty scarce. So, we're still figuring stuff out. It's, uh, let's try and get these guys, but I don't know if this is a good idea or not. Are they just way slower? I keep trying to aim with that one, which I know isn't right, but I really wish it was. Yeah, that must be it. Alright, so we'll go ahead and glitch this guy too, if we can get to him, and we can. So he's glitched. But there's like something weird by him too. Alright, maybe we'll just leave all that alone. Alright, so we can kill that. Is there a way to glitch the steam off in here? No, doesn't look like it. So we're not making it through that anytime soon. There's not really a way to stand still and try and glitch these guys. I can't jump up there anyway, so I shouldn't really care about that. Save point. It's pretty awesome. We're going to get full health from this as well, which is always helpful. I'm looking forward to that. Game saved, which is good as well. Don't want to lose that data. Alright, we'll kill these guys real quick. Easy. It seems like staying far away from stuff is kind of the optimum way to go through Axiom Verge, but we'll see. Another one of these guys. See, it's, it's hard to, like, just hit him, I guess. Is he fully glitched, or should I have kept... Because he seems to still be freaking out, but some of the other ones just kind of changed color, and then we're cool with it. Nobody crapped out a bunch of health, so... And this is obviously the way to go through things, and we can kind of do this but you can't hold it in a direction. Which is kind of what I was complaining about earlier. I wish right stick was just aiming for when I wanted to aim instead of the weird uh, weapon changing system that they've implemented, which I'm not a huge fan of. Maybe that's just me. And like I said, I mean, we'll probably figure out why they did that later on. I mean, they spent, game, they spent time developing the game and figuring out exactly what buttons needed to be where, what they needed them to do. Oh, I can just do this. Radical. Yeah, those things are way easier. Everything's kind of way easier to kill uh, when you glitch it out. It gives you health. It does things for you. It's working out okay. Can I de-glitch this? I'm having a hard time telling kind of anything apart. There's not a lot of visual indications of how certain things work. I mean, like, why can't I glitch those areas? What is this garbage? Oh, I don't like this. Right, that doesn't appear to be working. Shit. Let's try and kill this from over here. That did not work. Oh my god. That was not good. That was a holy shit. Oh my god. Holy hell. That was not what I wanted out of life right there. Bad times. That dying, like that close to death sound is the worst thing. It sounds exactly like my alarm clock. Like there's no difference between that and my alarm clock whatsoever. So I love games like this because you never really know if you're going the right way. Um, you know, I could just be totally ass backwards right now and not supposed to be here. 
but it does seem to be kind of gating off things. I mean, you don't feel like you're gated, but it is a very, I don't want to say a linear progression, but you know, there's obviously been places that we just can't reach because of movement, really, I would say is the big thing. I don't like having to do that. I, I don't know. I mean, what I was saying is that there's probably going to be mechanics that come up later that utilize the buttons that I want to use for my... But we can change the controls as well, so... Like I said, I wouldn't want to do that until I have all the powers, until I know what's going on, because... I didn't develop the game. They did. So you think they would know. I need the health from this guy, so let's just do this. It's really cool that these guys drop health or every time you glitch them out. I mean, that's insane, because health has been kind of scarce so far. Uh, so it's just cool that... Yeah, I don't know why I thought I could do that. Is there any reason to try and go over here? No. The wall repels me, which is not good. I can fill up on health from, from this doofus over here, so that's fine. Jesus. It was a little too high, that one right there. A little too close for comfort. And that second hit made me not be able to heal up. I can't get through this. Can I glitch anything here? Because I was able to glitch platforms before. It doesn't look like there's anything we can do. We can't go that way either. Let's just kill this thing really quickly. Gotcha. Perfect. I really... Are these unkillable? No, they're not. But I wonder if just another one just shits out and we're only getting like one hit on it. I wonder if we have to do multiple hits uh, on one pass by this guy. Okay, no. Is it dead? Okay. Oh, this is perfect. Oh, these guys aren't bad at all. I freaked out last time. You gotta keep your cool. What, what did I just shoot that got pissed off? Oh, amazing. Fantastic. Look at that. Made it through fine. Oh, shit. No, no, no. I'm fine. That was just my thumb accidentally hitting that. Oh, you can hit their tails, too. It's pretty much anything glowy you can kill. If it glows, you can kill it. Oh, just barely made it over that. These jumps. Sick platforming skills. What is what is going on here? I can glitch big bubbles. Can I probably stand on those or something? This is just a rip-off of Wave Man. It's the entire game. Ripping off poor Wave Man. No, I can't. What the hell are these weird little... Sperm ass things shooting all over the place. I don't need any of that in my life, thank you. Let's just go this way. It's fine. What's going on here? It's a glitch. It's not freaking out, so it's probably not a glitch. The glitches kind of glow and stuff. Oh, maybe we'll power up our drill and be able to drill through red blocks. Well, that's just like a different color. Oh, look, it's baby. It's a different. What is this? Another one of these? That's what I said. Hello, miss. Are you awake? Trish says, Faruska. She's in great need of repair drones. I, why am I helping these things? But she's very dangerous, but it's, she is fine. It's fine. Dangerous. I mean, I figured you were sort of network supercomputers. What? Why would you figure that at all? It's Cthulhu-esque, tentacle-ass uh, wires shooting out of their heads. Salki. It is like water machine? What the hell are you talking about? We have all been damaged. This situation you see is emergency. 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 No, that was... That was just a local commercial. That's not even a joke people are going to get. If you can enable repair drones, it will be greatly help. Power filter isn't enough. No, I got these stupid repair drones too. Bare minimum. Why am I making these things I'm obviously eventually going to have to kill? Hang in there, whatever you are. I'm not going to let you die without a fight. Why? Why is this guy doing any of this? He should be fetal position in room one. He was a scientist. Man, back off, man. I'm a scientist. Can I jump on your face, lady? Let me shoot you a little bit. She is dangerous, but she's our buddy. It's totally okay. Is, are, is she going to tentacle my way up there eventually? Probably. Be like, yo, I'll help you out. It's cool. It's cool. Or I come that way after I get Morph Ball, which I assume there's going to be a Morph Ball because there's tons of places where I need to, like, well, I can kind of do that, so maybe that's it. 
there's tons of places that are really small that I feel like I need to get through. All right, so I guess we're doing this, except like there's a way down, but there's not a way, yeah, there is. There's gotta be a way down. Is this, it stops the bubbles from coming out. The bubbles don't hurt me though. Bubbles don't do shit. What is this game? Is it over here? No, 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 it's just somewhere. All right, hold on. I get come from this. Nope, too strong, too strong for that. Okay, so I can get a couple shots in. Just being cool, just being cool, just chilling. Oh, this isn't so bad. This is easy. I do this all day. Didn't even a problem. Look at me murdering stuff. Full health. Street G over here. Oh, this is probably bad. They have, like, a limited range, and they seem to just flip out and go wherever the hell they want. I'm gonna go the way they had the enemy, obviously. Yo. Tons of these dudes. Screen-wide blasts are amazing. The shotgun's probably really good, too. I should probably start using that a little bit more. Oh, I guess that's my feet. Okay, I can catch him. Here he comes. Yeah, suck it, dickbag! Oh my god, I'm so good. Oh shit, there's no way for me to get up here. Didn't do stuff. Oh, I should have tried to glitch those guys. I don't know what I'm doing here. I'm gonna go the other way. Hopefully this thing didn't spawn back. That would have been a bitch. We're taking so much damage. It would have been insane. Yo, safe spot again. Look at us go. Oh, I'd say that's it for this episode, but I'm not done yet. Let's just let's push the envelope. Let's push it to the limit. What is happening? I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't, I don't like it. Okay. Alright, this is not bad. Little sperms can't get me here. Amazing. Alright, perfect. Fantastic. I guess those things slow me down. I can't jump aside when I'm in them, so. Just freak out these weird heart things. No. Oh, this is bad, this is bad. Got one right on my six. Stuff's not that hard to kill. Oh, the bubbles stop your shots. I was like, why am I not shooting anything right now? Can I do this? Well, you know what you do is you go this way. Nope, nope, nope. I meant to do this. Why is it? Oh, it's hitting the stupid vine things. All right. That seemed to kill them a lot faster. I can't make that jump, is there? I can't jump on these bubbles, these red ones. So I can't glitch anything, then. I was wrong about the being able to glitch that. Very methodical. These games... They're very puzzle-like, you know. Games like this, you have to you have to take them one step at a time, very carefully. Yo, get some sweet music here. Very carefully figure out what the hell you're doing. All right, so that guy's all glitched. Uh, he seems to be doing the same shit as always. Oh, oh, oh! That seems so much worse than it did before. I can't kill that. I made it unkillable. It seemed like it was a big mistake. It seemed like a good idea at the time, you guys. It really did. I should avoid glitching those things then. That one even crapped out health. I didn't even have to do anything. So we... Oh, shit. Okay, that was bad. So they apparently do that. Oh, this is... Okay, too fast for him. Too fast. Okay, nope, nope. Oh, shit. Okay, that wasn't good. It wasn't the best performance I've ever... Okay, murdered. Okay, we'll just go through and murder these assholes. That's what I'm so I thought it was on this one, so I let my guard down. Okay, just screw that one. Oh, this is bad timing. This is bad timing. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. Murdered. Kilt. Okay, good. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Murdered and stuff. Killing indigenous life forms for no reason. Well, these are kind of, well, they're just kind of defending themselves. You know, they're just doing their thing here in the world, trying to get by. It's work a day world. Oh my god! It just keeps going. Murder those guys. Okay, we're doing it. 
Okay, this place eventually has to have... Yo, I'm getting into this music. Can't do it. It cannot be done. What's going on here? Yo, 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 yo. I don't like this. Oh, I figured I could kill all of them. Will they die in one hit? I wonder if that's a glitched effect or just how these guys are. Oh, I just killed them trying to get a little life, but they didn't take much damage off me. So, I don't like this. Okay, we're fine. Merman jumping out of the water? No. That's a shame. I always want Merman jumping out of the water. This is shitty. Can I do this? No, obviously not. Why did I think I could? I don't know, because I'm a stupid person. All right, a couple shots in on this guy. I like I'm killing multiple things at once. I'm the best. Did it die? I don't know. I don't actually know. I'm assuming the water is a one-hit kill because this is a 2D platformer. So, I'm going to go ahead and just assume that's true. You never know, though. Okay, murder those things. Oh, can't crawl through that. Okay. Now I'm just straight up playing Kid Icarus, but whatever. Oh, shit. Well, I tried, I tried, but that's fine. They don't take very much health. These honeycomb things. Okay, bees and stuff. Have we only beat, like, two bosses? What is this? Axiom Verge! Field Disruptor. All there's local physics to augment jumping ability. Yo! -ho -ho! Jumping around like a damn jump man here. Look at me jumping. Jumping all over the place. You know what I should have to go back in here. I'm going to bid you guys adieu. Thank you so much for watching this episode. We're jumping in now. We're jumping. We're jump women. It's really... I don't want to be like that. Jump. We can all jump. Jump, jump, jump around. That's what that game's about. It's about unity. It's about jumping as one. That's what the song's about, not game. Well, I don't know. Mario's probably about unity too. Who knows? It's about I was farming in my backyard and I found a fucking turnip. And I was like, I don't know. What if a dude jumped over this? That's not even what happened. He was farming in a train. And the train was going by the radishes, and he went, what if I was farming, and the Pikmin came, and then he found a sword and a stone, and he was like, what if Zelda was able to slay all the Pikmin with the Master Sword? And then that's how you got Samus. That's the story of um, Nintendo. Now they're going to they're gonna try and get my money off this video. They're going to be like, you can't use this. Uh, let's get out of here, because I'm probably friggin' uh, getting a bad end because I'm taking so long talking. Thanks a lot for watching. I'll see you guys next time.